this time of the year, you'd expect the road construction to start wrapping up here. If you have a look at this map, still plenty of projects ongoing around the area. Not as many of those a month ago. One, though, is starting today right here at the Hoover Reservoir, and that's going to include the detours and closures, but no road is being worked on. Andrew Michaels joining us now near Westerville with a look at what's getting fixed. Andrew? Yeah, I'll spin you around here. I'm on the banks of the Hoover Reservoir, and you can see the little ripples and waves in the water. They're not very big. However, this bridge here, the Smothers Road Bridge, it was installed over 60 years ago. And even though these waves are very small, over time, it's put this road into jeopardy. Hoover Reservoir is a great place to take your dogs or go boating or try to catch the big one. But the age of Smothers Bridge is catching up to it. Slip of the current embankment, and that's due to erosion. Over the last 60 years, the banks have seen a lot of action. Fluctuating reservoir levels and wave action that's kind of been lapping at the side of the roadway. So they need to add more rocks to the banks. Crews were setting up today and surveying the area. Later this week, the dump trucks will start hauling the 20 tons of dump rock. 20 to 25 trucks a day. The trucks will dump the rocks on the road. There's going to be a crane that will actually be uh, grabbing the dump rock and then picking it up and moving it over and dropping it on the actual embankment. And as far as taking detours around the reservoir, you have two options. You can either take Central College Road on the south side below the dam, or my favorite, a little bit more scenic as you cross the Hoover Reservoir, is Sunbury Road to the north. I talked to a few of the people who live near there, and they said they don't mind the detour at all since it is only a couple of minutes out of the way. And for the city, a two-month project will help add years to the bridge. So we would be putting the road at danger if we didn't, you know, get in here and get ahead of things. And traffic will be closed for two months going across the bridge here. But if you want to go boating under the bridge, that is definitely doable. They've actually added extra buoys to the north side where they're going to be doing that construction. Just so that way, if there are any boaters, they know to kind of stay away from that construction site. Reporting here along the Smothers Road Bridge, at the Hoover Reservoir, Andrew Michael, ABC 6 News.